If you recently upgraded your Mac to OS 10.10, .10, that's Yosemite, and you're running Mac Office 2011, you may be encountering issues sort of similar to these where you launch Microsoft Word and after a few seconds it actually crashes on you. Uh, same thing was happening with Excel. I would launch it, it would stay there for a few seconds, and then after a few seconds it would actually crash. And this was also happening on PowerPoint as well. So I figured out a couple of things that you can do to prevent this from happening. And I'm going to walk through uh, the various steps that I had. And there is a blog post on my website at www.hitechdad.com. And I'm going to just quickly walk through these steps and show you how you can get Office 2011 working again on your Yosemite-based Mac. So the first and probably most obvious fix is to simply uninstall and reinstall Microsoft Office 2011. And you can do that fairly simply. The problem is it didn't always correct the problem. So I'm going to walk through a couple of steps with using some other programs, one free and one that you actually have to pay for, that seems to correct the issue. So one program that I really recommend, and it costs about $10, is Yosemite Cache Cleaner. And it's got a variety of different maintenance things. You can repair permissions, clean log files, you can optimize things. But one thing that I did use was this light cleaning and cleaning of the local cache. And so you basically run that and your system will reboot. And I found that this actually did fix uh, my issue one time. But I'm also going to show a free version of another software that seems to correct the, the issue of Office crashing as well. So the other program, and this is freeware, uh, is called Onyx, and there is a version for Yosemite. And within Onyx, there is a section called Cleaning, and if you go to the font section, you can actually try this out and see if it works. So basically I'm checking off the Microsoft Corporation and it's going to delete the fonts cache for any kind of Microsoft installed fonts and that sort of thing. So you execute it, it's going to close out a bunch of uh, open applications. Obviously I won't be able to record during this process. But then what you want to do is you could reboot your system, probably the best thing to do, or you could try launching Office and, and see if everything works. So I'm going to execute this and uh, come back and see how it does repairing the issue with Microsoft Office. Okay, so I finished doing the cleaning of the Microsoft fonts using Onyx, and I have not restarted my computer. Um, but I wanted to see if this actually worked. So we're starting Microsoft Word, and you can see right here it's doing an updating font menu. And this is what happens when you do delete the font cache. So it still seems to crash. So we're going to try some other things to see if, if we can fix it. So this time using Onyx, I'm going to check off all the various font caches within Onyx and execute that. So it's going to quit all other applications, so we'll come back after this is all done. So we're back after deleting all the font caches. You can see here, cleaning is finished, and it's going to ask me to restart my computer, and this is because I actually deleted some system fonts just for fun. I'm going to close this, not restart right now, and see if Word will actually launch. It's doing the updating font menu again, and let's see if it makes it through, and it still crashes. So I'm going to reboot and come back. So we're back after rebooting, and let's see if Word is still crashing. Launching, it didn't rebuild any of the fonts, and here it is, and it seems to be okay for a second and it crashed. So another thing that people have reported actually works is to check your fonts and you can do this by launching the font book and then looking for enabled duplicates. So I have font book here 
and I can do a search for that and I'm it says that I have one duplicate font I'm going to resolve it automatically move it to the trash and then I'm going to quit out of that and try launching Word again, see if that resolves anything. And so we launched it and it's still crashing. So the main reason I'm showing all these processes and how they're not working is to show you that not everything always works on the first try. There are a lot of different scenarios that you have to test out and what may work for one person might not work for another person. So as I mentioned before, Yosemite Cache Cleaner has always come to the rescue for me. I'm going to see if doing a light local cache, which does require a reboot, will actually help this issue. So this is Yosemite Cache Cleaner. I have it set to clean local cache. When I click the clean, it's going to ask me to reboot and then we'll come back and take a look at Microsoft Office once again once it does reboot. So it's going to run it and it's going to restart. So we're back after the reboot of using Yosemite Cache Cleaner and doing a light cleaning and I'm firing up Microsoft Word. It's probably going to rebuild some of the caches and here it is. It's launched and so far it's stable getting the beach ball but so far it hasn't crashed yet. If it does crash, we're going to have to go back to the drawing board and try some other things. So far it looks like it's okay. I'm typing on it. So looks like it's stable. I'm going to try Excel. Excel seems to have launched. Typing into a cell there. And then PowerPoint. I'm launching as well and starting up a presentation as well there. So it looks like everything is uh, stable after doing the light cache cleaning using uh, Yosemite Cache Cleaner. You can also try a, a deeper cleaning, and like I said, this, this utility is really great. I use it at least once a week um, just to do regular maintenance and that sort of thing. So as I mentioned before, there are lots of different ways that could fix it, and, and on my website there are a bunch of comments of people have tried different types of things, so you may want to take a look at that. You can just do a search on Google for how to fix Mac Office 2011 crashing in Yosemite, or you can go to my website at www.hitechdad.com, and you can ask me on Twitter, and I'm at HitechDad, and you can head over to my Facebook fan page and give me a like if this stuff worked for you, and that's at facebook.com forward slash htdblog.